Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. This is just a quick video in response to a suggestion I was given by one of my subscribers, Gerhard Monroe, and I thought it a very uh, useful tip and suggestion, so I thought I'd make a quick video on it. Now, what it is, is basically you use two command lines using command prompt, and it just gives you some more in-depth information regarding your uh, RAM on your device and also your hard drive. And this is very useful if, say, uh, you want to determine, as an example, how many RAM slots are occupied on your device, what RAM is currently installed. Maybe you need to order uh, another RAM module of the same type, as well as your hard drive. Maybe you want to set up a RAID uh, drive system or your hard drive um, you know, is damaged and you want to replace it. And this is especially beneficial if you are using a laptop, which is a bit more complicated to open up and get and maintain this information. Now, what we need to do is we just right click on our start menu and you run command prompt as admin and you can also search for command prompt in the search and at the prompt you enter this command and now, now this is too long to mention in this video but I will leave both of these command lines down below that I'm showing you today so you can just copy and paste and check this out for yourself and then after you've entered that command hit enter and now you can see the information regarding your RAM the bank label, capacity, caption, device locator, manufacturer, part number, and even the serial number. So I think that's some useful information. And then regarding your hard drive, I just need to copy this quickly. This will give you some useful information regarding your hard drive. And at the next prompt, you just enter this command, which I'll also leave down below. Hit enter again. And here you have your media type, model, serial number, and size. So I think that's just some useful and handy information regarding your RAM and um, hard drive on your device, especially if you are running a laptop, as I mentioned, and you need to replace any of these, uh, uh, the RAM or the hard drive on your laptop. So thanks to Gerard, and I thought this was very useful. So I just wanted to share it with you today. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.